as Tatiana pointed out, she uh, said that um, animals are used to being eaten. It is the circle of life. How, and they are not used to being tested on and caged and you know, just, t just tested on and abused. However, do we not cage them to eat them? Do we not hold them in cages, take them out, slaughter them, and then eat them? I believe what she's saying is completely wrong. Either way, they're caged, and either way, they're abused. However, one is for scientific research, and one is for us to eat them. They are treated much, much worse when they're going to be eaten than when they are to be used for research. Um, without animal testing, there will have been no scientific advancement in the last 100 years. I have a quote here that says, um, the California Biomedical Research Association states that nearly every medical breakthrough in the last 100 years has resulted directly from research using animals. And this is actually very true. Um, in regards to medical devices, every single medical device in the last 100 years has been tested on animals. Um, a example I like to use very often is pigs. Pigs are very, very anatomically similar to humans. Their hearts are the same size as humans. Their body temperatures are within one degree of humans. Their kidneys, their digestive systems are all in the same spots in the bodies and they're all relatively the same size. They make very, very good human analogs for testing medical devices on. Um, without these medical devices, the life expect expectancy would be 20 or 30 years less than it is now. There would be no stents, there would be no, uh, there would be no drugs to combat uh, heart disease and obesity. Um, if without the use of animals for research, um, imagine you have a, a grandparent that, you know, I don't know, fell down the stairs, right, okay, and they broke their hip. If there was no medical research, there would be no hip replacement for them because there's no other way for us to test this hip replacement other than on an animal, unless it's in a human, but that's morally wrong. There would be no research. There would be no uh, advancement. That's basically what I'm trying to say. Um, actually, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I think I successfully refuted everything that Tatiana had to say.